If you're headed into the ER, you're rarely in a position to make choices about using in- or out-of-network doctors. But when the bills come due, the dollar amounts can be staggering. After paying $700 in deductibles, I got the surprise bill of over $1,600 wow. for a five-minute face-to-face time with the physician. Donna Beckman and others shared nightmare stories about surprise medical bills with Senator Maggie Hassan Thursday in Manchester. Hassan recently filed legislation aiming to end the practice that has caused financial and emotional hardship for patients like Eliza King. She says she spent countless hours trying to resolve a bill sent to her 11 months after receiving care. Back and forth, back and forth, and every time somebody would say, okay, you're going to, it's all, all set. And then I would get another bill in the mail, and, you know, you're trying to piece together what happened months and months ago. Hassan's plan would require providers and insurance companies to negotiate amongst themselves when there's a disagreement over the bill. We need to take the consumers out of it. This is something that people don't have any control over. It's not consumers being a victim for their own ignorance or anything like that. It's, I mean, I hate to use the term unfairness, but yeah, it's unfair and it's completely unjust. Senator Hassan has her colleague, Senator Jean Shaheen, teaming up with her on this bill, and she's co-sponsor of Shaheen's legislation to try to combat rising out-of-pocket health care costs for the uninsured and those on the individual market. And that's really also about incentivizing providers to join insurance networks and keeping the overall cost of health care down. In Manchester, Adam Sexton, WMUR News 9.